It's a new way to learn about ancient art. A UNM professor helped design a new project that brings his and other Pueblo signature pottery designs to life. News 13's Brittany Bates shows you. So we all have ties to clay in one way or another. Using the techniques and designs passed on for generations. I get a lot of joy out of it. UNM professor and member of the Tewa Pueblo, Clarence Cruz, and... Acoma Pueblo artist Michelle Loudon. Acoma pottery is really well known for fine lines. Helped bring native pottery into the 21st century. It's a big ceramic piece. The imagery can wrap around it. The Pueblo Pottery Project was started by Corrales based IDEM, known across the country for making interactive exhibits, including part of the new Penguin Chill at the Albuquerque Biopark. We wanted to do something that we knew spoke to to the local community, to New Mexico. The interactive exhibit lets people design their own traditional Oya pot while teaching them about the meaningful symbols they're using. They each symbolize a prayer for rain in some ways. Well, the project started out as research. And it wasn't for a specific museum or anything like that. It has now been so well received, winning several national awards, the exhibit is now looking for a permanent home. <laughs> and is hoping to add even more Pueblo's designs to the always changing art. It's good to move forward, but also remembering to hold on to what is true to your culture. Brittany Bade, KRQE News 13. That's cool. IDEM is looking for a museum to permanently display the pottery project. They would like to see it stay in New Mexico.